Well, good afternoon. It's Audrey from Odds and Ends, and this is going to be something a little different. Still favorite, one of my favorite companies to order from on this Flying Monkey Totes, but this is one of her hand-painted um, leather handbags. Now, th this was delayed a little bit, and I knew it would be, because, you know, it does, it's custom. She only paints them after you get the order. And then <laughs> life happens. She just got done moving. She got sick. The Her supplier for her leather handbags um, stopped, stopped supplying them. So she had to find another company. And she didn't like the ones that got sent in. So anyway, she had said that she was going to send me a few little extra goodies to make up for the long delayed wait and um the inconvenience and she said I was so patient and of course I'm patient this was a Christmas present to myself it's not Christmas yet so now it's December and I'm opening and I'm not waiting till Christmas so here's the box and it's quite heavy so I know it's not just a leather bag in here and very cute stickers like always started to open the package so you won't see me struggling with it and occasionally the tape will get stuck to the box so I didn't really want to fight on camera with it of course I should have opened it more before <laughs> it's still hard to open mm. how are you guys doing today uh yep still stuck to the box open it up. Okay. Oh, what cool. It's a tarot spread sticker on the box. The question, the answer, the pros, the cons. Cool spread. And we have her business card. And if you haven't checked her out, if you like crystals, if you like hand painted things, you have whimsy, go check her stuff out. She's got so much stuff. Um, very, very talented. <laughs> oh, Sarah, you're good. Thank you. She always sends a little thank you card and some stickers. We've got an angel of cups. Hand, a little bottle of elixir, huh, looks like a chariot with two s cat people sphinxes. <laughs> uh, oh, we got a couple things in here. My box, my purse might not even be in here. Okay, we have, oh, it's Audrey's December Tarot and Tea Box. Oh my goodness, so that's not even what's in here, unless it's in here and it's just the bottom. We will have to see. So I'll tell you about this in a minute. I don't want, I, since I'm completely shocked about this, we're just going to keep, we're just gonna keep going, digging in. I got it. Russell Stover's Mint Patty. Russell Stover's, I love them. The marshmallow ones are my favorite, but let's see. And who doesn't like a little baggie with stars and moons on it? And it shimmers and yeah, we're all good with that. All good with that. What I think I just cut the name in half. <laughs> it's really gonna be a surprise. Uh, it would, wouldn't matter. I know what it is. It's a clear quartz lightning bolt. How cool is that? I do like that. Very neat. And yay, it looks like I got some tea and 
I'm completely out of her teeth, so we are, this is a lovely surprise. Okay, <laughs> this is not normally this difficult to open. She's got December packing tape this, this week. Okay, we have Italian blood orange. It's organic honey bush and rubios, orange peel, saff flower, and hibiscus. If I'm not mistaken, this one smells divine. And who does not like blood orange? Because it's just... Mmm. Orange is one of my favorite. One of my favorites. Okay. Oh, what a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful box. <sighs> So many pentacles on it. It is so pretty. I love it. Velvet on the bottom. Oh, very, very, very beautiful. I'm gonna open it up. And you know what? I'm gonna have to wait some longer for my purse. <laughs> uh, Sarah, this was a good, uh, good trick. Thank you. <laughs> I guess I was expecting my purse and maybe one or two little things. I wasn't expecting a complete December, you know, tarot and tea box. Ah. So we have the Jung, Jungian Tarot. I have no idea how to pronounce it. It's by Robert Wang. I probably should see. Probably a little too close. Um, Dr. Robert Wang developed the Jungian Tarot as a visual gateway into the complexities of the Jung Jungian psychology to aid in the process of active imagination proposed by Carl Jung. Jung? Jung? I, I guess I'm not familiar. The 22 major arc Arcana represents Jungian archetypes of the collective unconsciousness. The figures are visually presented with archways and circular mandalas. I love mandalas. I have two tattoos of mandalas, which aid in meditation. Um, the deck is a companion to the Jung Jungian Tarot Trilogy by Robert Wang. Okay. I'll have to do a flip through. But let's get through this box first, and then I'll do a flip through another time. <laughs> okay, I believe these are her candles. Nope, We've got Palo Santo dipped in something yummy. Mmm, so yummy. So, so yummy. Set this down. And we have two Hershey bars. And no one is ever going to complain about um, that. And we have patchouli incense sticks. And maybe these are the candles. Let's see. always want to be careful. I don't want to cut something good in half. Sarah, you really got me good on this one. <laughs> Which is fine. Oh. I cannot wait to see my purse. Every weekend, I was like, I, I want my weekend purse. Oh. But it is a Christmas present to myself. So 
as long as I get it by Christmas, I won't be disappointed. So we have two red candles. I'll tell you what, they're scented. It kind of smells like chocolate, but it kind of doesn't. Um, got a pink skull here. Two red candles. Very festive. And she dropped another charm in here. Another skull. And we have a palm stone, which I don't know if you knew. I needed more palm stones. Palm stones are really good when I am stressed out. So I'm going to assume this is Larkavite. And I'll tell you in a minute, there's no label on it, but I'm assuming that's what this is. And we have another T. This is the tarot and T box, not the crystal and T. And oh, black salt, it's not T. Good thing I read it. It's, I'm trying to think what it smells like because it does have a scent. And we have one very heavy cube here. I am assuming this is black obsidian. And I love the little cutout. I'll show you. It sits like that. It's very, very, very cool. Thank you, Sarah. And let me see what the, the cheat sheet said. Oh, dude, and I buried it. Where did it go? And you guys all know that I don't do anything. I, I have a package and I open it and I haven't even unchanged from work. I did take my necklace off and my overshirt because it was a little warm in the house. Okay, so, okay, it's Audrey's December Tarot and Tea Box. We have the deck, the crystals, there's black obsidian cube. Um, possessing tremendous energy, the black obsidian clears negativity, grounds and heals. Use black obsidian to confront your shadow self as we must experience both light and dark for true healing and evolution to occur. Carried by wise men, shaman, and alchemists due to its amazing healing properties. Larvakite, yep. Palmstone, dark and luminescent. Lark, Larkavite Larkavi is protective, cleansing, and grounding. Highly regarded for repealing negative energies the stone enhances confidence and creativity an ideal stone for meditation as it eliminates excessive thought sharpens concentration stimulates inner vision and enhances psychic ability the jewelry is the clear quartz lightning bolt pendant leather cord the master healer clear quartz amplifies focuses transmits and regulates energy revered for both Cleansing and diverting negative energies. Clear quartz contributes to our overall strength and well-being. And then the apothecary is Italian blood orange tea. The lavender dipped palo santo sticks. Beeswax candles, which is almond and jasmine oils, ground palo, passion flower, and cinnamon. Incense is the patchouli sticks. Black salt. Protective black salt helps keep surrounding safe by driving away both physical and spiritual harm sprinkle around the home and toss into footprints of negative individuals to prevent their return dress black, black dress black candles in oil and black salt to repeal negativity use in protective and banishing spell work to drive away evil during ceremony and ritual and the miscellaneous is the metal tarot storage box it's velvet lined with a secure latch and stickers and chocolate. 
Thank you, Sarah. So everyone, go check her out. I've never, ever been disappointed in anything she's ever sent me. I love it all. And this was a complete surprise. Very lovely gift. Thank you, Sarah. And I can't wait to show off your purse. And then everyone will love it as much as I do. And you'll probably get tons more orders. And then you'll just be like, Audrey, I don't like you anymore. So <laughs> anyway, have a wonderful day, guys. And I'm going to go enjoy my things, make some dinner. And I will talk to you later. Bye.